Hello, Hello guys. guys! Welcome to Architect Hong. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and turn on your notification bells. Please share it with your friends and follow us on Instagram. Enjoy the video! Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial of SketchUp. In today's video, we're going to talk about how to render a model in SketchUp. As you can see, I already um, I'm have a ready villa. And uh, from here, you have to have a kind of extension called Pladium. So if you're using the crack version, you cannot download the, the plugins uh, from the from the extensions over here uh, but if you are using the uh, the original version of course you can download them from here by just using Platinum, and it will bring you the the render types of course sketchup has many many type of rendering but uh, i'm using this uh Platinum, which is one of the best i believe i always use it in my projects so if you have the crack version I will put a link in description how to add any kind of uh, plugins or extension in your SketchUp and also I will put a link where you can download this um, SketchUp, uh, this plugins files. So let's start. Uh, the first thing we have to do is you have to make sure that your shadows on where the shadows um, affecting the building. It's really important, uh, I believe. Uh, when you are doing model as you can see i have my shadows over here now the second thing is we have to go up on the options and we have to change things but before we're going to render make sure you change the settings before you render it's really important and if you if you don't believe me go ahead and make a render and see that the effects so now once you came here on the options you have from image format three choices which called jpeg and hdr and most of the time i'm using png uh, for testing it's really good but for the jpeg it will compress the image which is not really good i really don't recommend you but for hdr it will give you with more details it will give you with highest quality and it will be more good uh, well for the PNG it's just for testing let's do it for the testing and uh, you have the chance also uh, to use it uh, as a transparent here now let's go to image safe location as you can see it says model so once it says model what does it mean it means where did I save my model it will save the image the exact place where my sketch of file is so if you want to save it in different place you have to go to custom from here you choose any kind another type of uh, browser for example let's go to this sub and i'm going to save it somewhere over here and that's it guys for this point from here you will go to fix and from here you will choose 90 20 and 1080 it's one of the best i always pick this one it's one of the best resolution i believe but if you want to have it with higher quality you can pick it from here so it's really up to you it's totally up to you and um, from here it's uh, as you can see everything is fixed now let's go to environment from environment when you enter from here as you can see uh usually when you are it's your first time let's do it reset for example for this part uh, as you can see uh, it will usually give you the option of clay but uh, i recommend you to uh, to use soft uh, because clay it usually brings you only white colors and not the materials actually so it's really important to go to soft so what will be what's the second thing we have to do is we will save the file and we will click on the rendering now once you came over here it will go on the process part so i will cancel it because i already have rendered the file so i don't want to waste the um, time and it will pop out another file something like that uh, so from here you can see your file by clicking on show so this is the result i got from my rendering as you can see it's really good and everything is perfect as you can see the shadows over here and uh, 
everything is much more realistic also you can do for the interiors as well i will show you i did one also for the interior uh, where did i save the file for example this is a sketch of file i download from internet and i saw the interior and as you can see the shadows over here then i did a rendering for it so let's see how it looks like as you can see uh the rendering for the interiors it really goes with much more details as you can see from here the shadows how it affect on the wall and also in the pillow and the sofa it's really good so um uh, for uh for this video it's going to be that's it if you have something that in my mind want to ask me make sure you comment on the section comments and uh, thank you for watching I hope this video helped, if it did, make sure you give it a thumbs up and share it with your, with your friends, I really appreciate that. I hope to see you on the next video, have a great day, bye bye.